For almost 15 years, Holy Trinity Lutheran Church has been rooted right here in the Riverton community. For nearly a decade, our school and learning center have been sowing the seeds of Christ's love and educating nearly 100 children. It's Christ who planted us here, and with His blessings, we've literally grown so much we're bursting at the seams. We've completely outgrown our current facilities, challenging our ability to educate more children and evangelize to our neighbors. Which brings us to this exciting time and place of needing new construction. We'd like you to be a part of this brand new campaign, Rooted and Growing in Christ. We are taking another step, a bold step. We've done that before. When we originally bought this property and started planning the existing facility, we had already envisioned this next project. I want our congregation to be this beacon, to be our original um, light of the valley. We preach Jesus to often children who have really never been brought up in that kind of foundation. The mission of Holy Trinity Lutheran Church is to glorify the triune God by preaching Christ's gospel, by cultivating a atmosphere and a genuine fellowship between the people who are here and then we reach out to our neighbors and touch them and provide and give. What makes Holy Trinity special is this sense of family. The difference between this learning center and school is the traditional teaching means, the fact that our kids can develop a relationship with Jesus and learn that side of morals. We start our day out with Jesus time, and I certainly love the fact that we get to talk about Jesus every single day. I mean, all the time. We have waiting lists for infants through four-year-olds. This will allow us to address those needs, as well as ease on the setting up and taking down of the, of the sanctuary every Sunday and every Monday. We are a play-based center, which is so great because as you know, children learn through play. Playing in the kitchen, playing outside in the snow, and our teachers are very good about nurturing and playing with the children, not just standing off at the side and watching them from afar. At the very end of the day, I give them a big hug and I say, Jesus loves you and so does Miss Sue. It's like you're leaving them with an aunt and uncle or a grandparent, like you just know when you're leaving your kid here for the day while you're at work that he's in a great spot. Rooted and growing in Christ, which is what we proclaim with our mission, is exactly what we want to be and who we are. We can do this. We're all in this together. So you might be asking yourself, how can I help? Well, there's really three main ways you can help. First is you can pray. Taking the time to pray for this campaign and God's mission is the most important thing that you can do. And for that, we say thank you. Second, we ask for your talents. There are so many ways that you can use your God-given gifts to further this mission. There's a long list of to-dos and we'd love for you to be a part of this. Finally, we ask for your treasures. We aren't asking for more than you can give financially. We're simply asking you to pray about what God wants you to give above and beyond your regular tithes and offerings. Some are more financially blessed than others. You may be only able to donate $10 a month. And for that, we say thank you and God bless you for your gift. So just know that every dollar you donate is going to help spread the word of God, to help educate kids and raise up young children to also share God's message. <laughs>